Wendell Barnhouse, Big12Sports.com here with Kansas State Athletic Director John Curry. And we're going to talk to John about the new TV contract that the Big 12 announced with ABC, ESPN, and Fox. John, what does this mean uh, just to you as an athletic director in the conference? This is a, was a six-month process to get this contract finalized, but now that it's been set in stone, what does it mean? Well, obviously, Wendell is a huge leap forward for all of our 10 schools, and uh, we're indebted to the leadership that the conference office has provided and the commissioner, uh, Commissioner Bowles, be coming on board to push us across the finish line. A year ago at this time, nobody would have thought this would happen. Uh, in addition to this TV contract, it's a 13-year grant of rights. What does this mean for the Big 12 going forward now? Is this conference is in better shape than it probably has ever been? Well, it's it's a great feeling to be able to have persevered and and really uh, achieved uh, the stability that we all knew was po uh, was possible. Uh, the thing about it is, though, it's not stability. It's accelerating and it's momentum. Uh, and thanks to the great leadership of the presidents and the board of directors of our league, and of course the commissioner, as I mentioned earlier, uh, we are back in a position to provide leadership to the rest of intercollegiate athletics uh, instead of feeling like a follower there's going to be a lot of discussion about the revenue that this all the TV deal is going to generate It's probably almost going to double what schools receive from the Big 12 from a on a campus perspective what are some of the things that, that money can be used for you know that's that people maybe don't see or or they do see with like facilities that sort of thing well certainly our campus says we're in the process of investing hundred million dollars in facilities but it's important to remember that that money is invested across the whole uh, infrastructure of the department uh, so it's not all going to football or basketball it's going throughout the department in our case um, we're generating a lot of that money privately, uh, but all of the new television dollars, et cetera, are being invested back into the experience of our student athletes, back into our fan experience with upgrades in our stadiums, um, in, in, in areas that help the university's athletics departments be better partners with the, with the overall university. It wasn't too long ago that not all conference games could be seen uh, on, on television or on a broadcast medium of some sort. This contract guarantees that any time a Big 12 team plays, somebody's going to be able to see it if they want to. How important is that for all the membership schools to have that kind of access and exposure? Well, the exposure is tremendous, especially for those of us who are in relatively low population states. You know, K-State has 200,000 alumni, half of whom don't live in the state of Kansas, and we recruit student athletes from all over the country and all over the world. So being able to have all of our contests uh, televised uh, in some form is very important. At the same time, the Big 12's advantage is that we really do have, with our retained rights, uh, we have the opportunity to tailor to really each institution what their needs are to distribute all of our events. And so at K-State, for instance, we distribute live all of our volleyball games in high definition, all of our baseball games, all of our women's basketball games, and that's not something every other conference can do. John Curry, the Kansas State Athletic Director, talking about the new TV contract at the Big 12 signed with ABC, ESPN, and Fox. For the Big 12 Digital Network, I'm Wendell Barnhouse.